Jesus Christ is imminently picking his bride. How do you prepare for the kingdom of God through repentance in the name of Lord Jesus Christ? And they are living in truth, righteousness, holiness, and complete surrender to the Lord Jesus Christ, living day by day while watching and waiting for the imminent return of the Lord Jesus Christ, the darling of heaven. That is the bride of Christ. That Jesus Christ is coming to to Isnas and rescue to heaven. A dream where I was shown the bride of Christ being prepared for the rapture and also anguish, regret, and misery that will befall those who are walking on the broad road. On the night. 30 January 2012, I had a supernatural dream, and this dream, I found myself in the place that looked like a conference room, and I was seated together, and I was seated together with other people, and in front of us was a tutor. I believe he represented the Holy Spirit. And while in the dream, the tutor was instructing us to read on how Apostle Paul prepared his family for the coming of the Lord, and that we should follow Apostle Paul's teaching to his family in order for us to also be able to be ready for the coming of the Lord, Yeshua Jesus Christ. In the dream, I kept wondering, which is this family that Apostle Paul had? Because I did not remember reading any wife, mother, father, brothers, sisters, and children that Apostle Paul had in the Bible. I was then made to understand in the dream that the family had Apostle Paul had was the body of Christ. While in the dream, I was made to understand that Yeshua, Jesus Christ, was just about to rapture his bride, and that the people who had made time to prepare for his arrival were the ones who were in this room, and that they had made themselves ready, and had now been prepared by the Lord himself for his arrival. The number of people in this room was indeed very few, and I was made to understand that majority of the people are actually out of this room, and that they who are out of this room had not prepared themselves for the coming of the Lord, and that they had not allowed the Lord to prepare them for his coming through purification, cleansing and washing of his blood and the provision of his oil for their lamps through his word, the Holy Bible, and the sanctification by the Holy Spirit. In this dream, I also saw that people were awarded point marks and that people had different point marks based on what I was made to understand in the dream to be their service to the body of Christ, Jesus Christ being the head of this body. While still in this dream, a new perspective was brought to my attention and this was the fact that the time to make a choice for or against Yeshua Jesus Christ was indeed a very short time. However, the impression for this choice made was for a very, very long time, eternity, I. It is irreversible, irredeemable, and once the end of ages ends, then that it you cannot reverse it or go back and make your bizarre choice then. 
began to emphasize this issue to me in the dream. I was shown while in the dream what looked like a vision and in this vision I was taken post raptor scenario. And this looked like either during the great tribulation or after that I post great tribulation and I saw people in anguish, misery, with utter hopelessness and regret. These are people who had missed the raptor and were now in torment. What I was made to understand to be tormenting them was the fact that they had just like during no time not believed that Jesus Christ was coming to pick his bride. Those who had washed their robes garment in his blood and were now spotless and without wrinkle and so had not prepared for the coming of the Lord. They in fact had rejected Jesus Christ by insisting on walking on the broad road while ignoring the narrow road that was to lead of life. They longed to get another sense. They now were seeing the truth, but it was too late. There was now no more grace mercy for them. It is not categorically shown, declared to me in the dream whether this was hell, great tribulation era or post great tribulation era. All that I was made to understand was that this vision in the dream referred to a time when the bride of Christ had left with Jesus Christ through rapture and that the people who had rejected Yahshua, Jesus Christ, or were look on and had thus missed to go with the Lord were now in a state of anguish, misery, regret, panic, and eternal hopelessness. Probably they had been persecuted to take the mark of beast and so they had no hope for salvation. It is however important to note that after raptor there is hope for salvation for those who will not take the mark of beast. So long as they repent in the name of Yahshua Jesus Christ. But there is a Christ they would have to pray and that is being beheaded. The message that was imparted in my heart from this dream was that the people who are going to be raptured by the Lord Yahshua Jesus Christ are at the moment preparing for his coming and they have left the broad road where majority are and they have decided to be on the narrow road and not only are they preparing for the coming of the Lord but the Lord himself is preparing them by his Holy Spirit and his word the Holy Bible. The other message that was imparted in my heart during them is the people are going to be rewarded based on what they have done to the body of Christ and people are called for various services in the body of Christ. Some apostles, some prophets, some evangelists, some ashes, some worship team among us may many more other ways. But in all these there is reward based on what one has done. The last message I got from this dream is that in one's lifetime on the earth and especially at this particular point in the history of mankind, when the rapture of the bride of Christ is imminent followed by a seven-year great tribulation, 
the decision on max is irreversible, irremediable, and the decision is whether to accept Yahshua, Jesus Christ. What to to reject Yahshua, Jesus Christ? Salam. First Corinthians 12 verse 4 to 11. There are different king of gift, but this the same spirit distributes them. There are different kind of service, but the same Lord. There are different kind of working, but in all of them and in everyone. It is the same God at work. Now to is on the manifestation of the spirit is given for the common good. To one there is given through the spirit a message of wisdom, to another a message of knowledge by means of the same spirit, to another faith by the same spirit, to another gift of healing by that on spirit, to another miraculous powers, to another prophecy, to another distinguishing between spirit, to another speaking in different kind of tongues, and to still another day interpretation of tongues. All these are the work of on and the same spirit and he distributes them to each on just as determines prepare the way in absolute repentance to righteousness, holiness and full surrender to Lord Yahushua Jesus Christ. The message Jesus Christ is immediately coming to pick his bride. Today is my discussion over. Thanks everyone. Goodbye.